On this unbelievably quick tutorial, I'm gonna show you how to make the dead mouse ARP in Ableton in seconds. I have this mini clip pulled up. This is actually from dead mouse's pack. So we're gonna make it. First thing, I'm gonna go to instruments right here, then go to search and type in rubber. This is the starting main preset. So I'm gonna go to operator, pull this down, go to guitar and plucked, pull this down, double click. So this is already, in a sense, 90% of the way there. So I'm just gonna play it. Right? Next thing I'm gonna do, I'm gonna close this out, go to MIDI effects, double click velocity, pull this up, go to fixed, and maybe bring this down here right now. Right? So you can already hear, very slowly getting there now, once we adjust the velocity using the MIDI effect, I'm then going to go to the uh, decay. Maybe adjust this a bit however I want, but I might. As you can imagine, this is more for taste, however you want. Especially if you want to be like incredibly plucky, like aggressively plucky. That's the right phrase. Especially if I adjust this. I find. Usually around there, and then the release. If I want like that, or. At this point, sometimes like it's kind of random what amount I'll leave these on. A lot of this, I just kind of go by how it's sounding, to be honest. Right? Next thing I'm gonna do is now I'm gonna EQ this, kind of standard when it comes to using any synth, right? Especially if I'm not using this for like the bass. All right. Then he usually likes to add in maybe some light reverb and delay. So I'm gonna just double click reverb. Gonna like, you know, low key adjust these settings. Nothing too crazy. Remove some of the high when it comes to the diffusion. I can also parallel process this, but for the case of this video, I'm just gonna kinda do this relatively quick and then add in lastly a delay, put on fade. I can adjust it. Maybe just like. And then we bring this a bit more here. And there it is. 